which was part of the Kingdom of Poland at that time. In the 14th century was established University Library in Kraków, which still exists as the one of the few in Poland to escape damage. Libraries were always very important in Poland. If you wanted to flatter someone, in 16th or 17th century Poland, you should compare them to a library. The National Library in Warsaw was established as, the, as the one of the first in Europe. This year, uh, on August 8th, we celebrated 270th anniversary of its opening. And actually, in 18th century, it was one of the biggest public libraries in Europe, with 400,000 volumes and more than 10,000 medieval and early modern manuscripts. We have to mention that this year we have another important anniversary, 200 of Solineum you will have possibility to visit in Wrocław. We mustn't forget hecatomb of the Second World War, when Poland lost 70% of all its library collections. 70% through war damages, willful destruction or theft including most precious, though stored in the, national, in the National Library of Warsaw. 50,000 manuscript, manuscripts and 60,000 early printed books lost. And this loss is unequaled in modern history. And that is why during this Congress in Poland, we want to discuss not only about promoting reading and literacy, libraries as catalysts of innovation, but also about work with cultural partners to safeguard cultural heritage in its diverse forms, including traditional, historical, indigenous and contemporary expression. Polish libraries okay, can play a unique role in rescuing heritage in danger. We are willing and want to share our experience. I've been to many IFLA congresses and I of course enjoyed formal aspects, formal meetings. But what is really equally useful and sometimes even more exciting are the opportunity to network and to share ideas. I encourage you to make use 
the best use of this opportunity to build network, contacts, exchange visiting cards, build bridges as you can see on our logo. Don't forget, we librarians can open the door for the aspiration of old and young. Library is a place of safety, reassurance, community, calm, regeneration, learning, and solidarity, access to wisdom, knowledge, and beauty. In other words, a cornerstone of every civil society. Library is a sanctuary. This is not a window on the past, but a tool of modernization. Thank you. Thank you very much.